Hello everybody, this is Out of the Box Unboxing and in today's episode I'm going to review for you uh, electric impact wrench from Parkside available in Lidl that comes together with such nice uh, black box, black case uh, and um, before I will uh, go to technical details few words about this case uh, it's really so-so but it's good enough uh, also you, what you are getting as a package is uh, uh, four uh, impact wrench sockets starting from 17 followed by 19, 21 and 22 uh, so I will keep one for the test uh, and uh, you will also get a spare part for your electric motor okay and uh, what about other features? This um, uh, uh, electric impact wrench is, uh, uh, or um, I, I will compare it with a hybrid uh, wrench that I have uh, tested uh, um, a few months ago. It was cordless, but with extension rod that was uh, allowing you to uh, plug it in into your um, uh, car could be powered by a car, car or could get a power supply from, from, from your car. That was, a, I would say, smart, but not so strong in terms of uh, power, um, power consumption or power output um, uh, solution. This, however, by weight, you actually might see or might feel that it's a uh, it's piece of equipment. Uh, I didn't make a detailed measurements, but in my opinion, it's like a 2 kgs. Uh, it's decently balanced, so it's not so uh, uncomfortable to, to, to use it. It could be a little bit better, but I think it's more than enough. But uh, please notice that if you want to support it with your second hand, this part might be hot, so be aware of that. Uh, but if you are mm, doing, let's see, DIY repairs, I think it should not be a problem. But I will test it. I will test it. Is it heating up or not? Um, and yes, in terms of mm, basic parameters. Power consumption 450 watts, uh, maximum loosening torque 320 newton meters, uh, maximum tightening uh, torque uh, 100 newton meters, safety limited according to producer, uh, no load uh, rotation speed up to 3000 rpms. Quite, quite a high number. Uh, tool holder it's a um, uh, half uh, inch uh, external square this part uh, about accessories I have uh, mentioned that you are getting four of them four sockets 17 19 21 22 I think it's uh, what you need for standard usage and power cable length it's uh, three meters also more than enough if you need go some uh, if you need to take a longer distance, use an extension rod. Um, yeah, in terms of finishing, uh, the, the first impression, nice. Uh, I'm uh, very glad that um, Parkside uh, don't use this, mm, this rubber uh, at, 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 at the switch because it was uh, falling apart and it was disaster. So now it's rigid plastic, so it will withstand for a long time. In terms of other rubbers, uh, rubber finishings are mm, very, in my opinion, uh, good quality. Uh, the grip is very nice. Uh, on top of that, okay, it's part of the design, but it's also the protection, look on this. If you put tool back on the ground, whatever, 
it will touch immediately with this rubber so it will it it, it, it's, it gives it, it's giving a basic protection uh, when it's needed for those of you who didn't know uh, here uh, you can um, uh, exchange your spare parts for the motor that are included but it will in my opinion last for long so it's uh, rather theoretical uh, than uh, practical so but it is um, okay mm, what else I will now turn it on let's uh, hear how loud it is and then I will I will I will test is it uh, heating up I will think put let it go for 15 seconds I think no uh, no need to to go mm, more Uh, from safety reasons I will not tr even try to hold it and yes um, test of heating in 3 to 1 after 15 seconds no heat whatsoever uh, it's it's cold as it was I cannot feel nothing I will give it a try for another 15 seconds maybe but I say maybe here starts to be not not hot uh, not even warm I would say something about ambient temperature so in total I was using for 30 seconds which is if you screwing and unscrewing uh, your tires you have four of them uh, I don't think you will be using longer time it's like a it's I think two three seconds for each wheel and now actually uh, it's cooling down again so uh, I'm positively surprised about this tool I mean the practicality in terms of um, um, uh, power consumption second the how it's made because Qual Parkside quality wires from model to model. Sometimes it's better, sometimes it's worse. This definitely is one of the uh, the best. Uh, and yes, if you really need such tool, buy it. If not, consider uh, to use your, for instance, um, uh, uh, cordless drill or uh, or simple. Uh, unscrewing uh, um, wheels with uh, let's say old school manual way by using your uh, tools garage tools but if you are spending in your garage longer time I think it's uh, it's good price for the money for those of you who don't know how uh, uh, how, how much it was uh, in 2019 it's May it was around uh, 45 euros around 45 for, uh, 40 47 something like that so for cordless tool that is specifically uh, uh, for, for, for one or not for one but um, I mean in my opinion it's well made I think it's good uh, price for the money but I, as I mentioned if you are doing or now using it on the on the daily basis for DIY's usage I think it's it's a little bit spent um, uh, it's 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 not worth it but the tool as it is in my opinion is uh, well made thank you for watching stay tuned 
and see you next time. Bye.